okay so in this question dear students a particle with charge n times e is accelerated through a potential difference v what is the magnitude of work done on the particle well um okay so what what does this question means it means that let us say there is a there are two electrodes here one is positive another is negative and we have connected it with a battery and the voltage difference is v okay and there is an electron at this point obviously there will be an electric field that would be moving from positive to negative so elect so this electron will try to move towards the positive terminal initially the kinetic energy is zero that is velocity is zero and then this electron reaches the final point and the velocity becomes capital v or small small v so now the gain in kinetic energy is half mv square earlier the kinetic energy was zero so from work energy theorem we can say that work is equal to change in the kinetic energy so kinetic energy changes by half mv square now we can find this velocity how to find velocity by the laws of kinematics so laws of kinematics will be like um, v square minus u square is equal to 2as now uh, what we do is we want uh, kinetic energy so this will be zero so multiplying by half m on the both sides half m v square is equal to half into m into 2as so this and this gets cancelled so it becomes ma into s now what is this m into a ma is force f is equal to m into a so this is coming out to be equal to f into s now s is the distance that was traveled and f is the force now from electrostatic point of view the force will be given by q into e and s is basically the length l the length l of this uh, tube or whatever you want to say the accelerator the length is l now what is e into l so we know that e is equal to minus dv by dr this is a very famous formula and you must be knowing it so if this is l so i can say v is equal to e into l when we integrate it and we get this v is equal to e into l so in place of e into l you can write v so v is the potential difference across the two electrodes so that will be v now from this much what i have is that the formula for the work done is given by q into v now q is the charge on this charged particle which is an e any and v is the potential difference across the two electrodes which is capital v so our answer will be n e v so answer will be v now at this point at this juncture i would say i have given you the derivation for this formula although even that was not required because there is a unit in electrostatics and that unit for the energy is given by electron volt so if you are aware of electron volt so electron volt is defined like this only so the work done is equal to q into v straightforward the charge will be any and the potential difference is v so we could have reached the same conclusion by using the direct formulation also that the work done is equal to ev electron volt one electron volt is the work done and it is defined as it is the work done in accelerating one electron by the potential difference of one volt now if i say that the work done is let us say 5 ev what do you mean it means that one electron is accelerated by the potential difference of 5 volt or you can say five electrons have been accelerated by the potential difference of 1 volt so it's a very beautiful unit of energy that is created only for the sake of subatomic particles and the value of 1 ev is 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 joule so this is used for the conversions and otherwise this is the definition this is the derivation so with this this is professor varun all the best